All right, hey, what's up guys? It's Roy here. And with today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing the Spec Presidio 2 Pro case for my iPhone 13 Pro. Now, Spec was kind enough to send this case out for my review. So big thank you and shout out to them for supporting my channel. If you do wanna buy this case, it's $54.95. I got the black color, but it also comes like in a bluish coastal blue color. And then I think it's called rosy pink. So if you do wanna check those out, you can go to specproducts.com and purchase them. And right now, if you sign up with your email, they are doing 25% off. So let's go ahead and take a real quick peek here at the actual box and the packaging. So you got the spec branding here, the spec branding there, kind of that clear view to be able to see the case. Obviously, Presidio 2 Pro, MagSafe, which as you can see here, it is MagSafe compatible with built-in magnets. Guarantee with the warranty. Microband, which has a microband covering the case so it helps uh, to inhibit the growth of bacterial uh, crap on your case if you don't want that. And then 13 feet of drop protection. So you're getting some really, really good drop protection with this case. As you can see, it does say it is for the new Pro and it does have their Armor Cloud, which I'll talk about in a sec. And then going to the back here, as you can see, it just kind of talks a little bit about all the things that are pretty much on the front of the case, but we'll talk about that in this video. So the way to get it out is, as you can see here, pull the tab down and voila, there is the case. So as you can see here, guys, it is like a matte black material, very soft to the touch. You have a little pop of color there with the white spec branding there. And then as you can see here, uh, it's just a matte case. Now flipping over to the inside, as you can see here, you see that shiny high gloss armor cloud protection, which is really going to help with that drop protection and help dissipate the energy away from your phone if you do drop it. As you can see here, you got spec branding here. You have the MagSafe built-in magnets there. Got a hard plastic in there, but it is kind of soft too. So this is what your phone's gonna be going up against. And as you can see here, it says designed for impact. So let's go ahead and slap in the phone. So let me go ahead and grab my 13 Pro, pop the corners in and voila, there it is. So there is the matte black spec case on my Graphite 13 Pro here. So as you can see, you do have some pretty dang good lens protection. So you do have a bump that is protecting those camera lenses and the, the just hump in general. So you are definitely gonna be able to lay it back down without any worries. And then, like I said, the whole entire back is just this really nice, smooth matte black material, uh, very soft to the touch. No fingerprint issues, but I have noticed over my experience that it does get smudges and things like that. So I'm constantly using my shirt to wipe it down, but is what it is. Like I already mentioned, that pop of color there with the spec logo. On the sides, you do have a raised nice power button there. Uh, as you can see, it is a kind of a black gloss versus the matte black. And as you can see on the corners, you do have a glossy black bumper there as well and that kind of goes all around the whole entire phone but power button there on the bottom as you can see you have some nice clean cutouts there for your lightning port and your speakers and mic down at the bottom and then going to the side here as you can see you do have your glossy black volume up and down buttons that are raised as you can see so they're raised very nicely there and then you do have a very generous cutout there for your alert slider and then moving to the top obviously nothing but I do like to show this angle so you can kind of see how that uh, camera protection kind of sticks out just a tad bit there. Um, so yeah, and then on the front, raised lips all around the whole entire front of that screen. It is tempered glass friendly as well, guys, but as you can see here, uh, you do get some really nice screen protection with this case. And then as you can see there, that's kind of how it looks with the raised uh, speaker now, how it is raised up. So the case goes around it. So it does do a very nice seamless look. And as you can see there, that's kind of how it looks on the front. So let's go ahead and do the wobble test real quick and see if it's shaky. So let's do the back down first, which is probably what the most people care about. Now it is going to be wobbly, as you can see, definitely shaky just because of that giant bump there. And then if we do it face down, there is no shake at all. It is completely flat on the front, as you can see. So you're definitely going to be getting no shakiness out of it, laying it face down, but definitely back down. 
So the next thing that I wanna do is the clicky button test and see how clicky and responsive these buttons are. So let's start with that power button first. And volume up and down. Okay, so definitely clicky and tactile guys. So if you like clicky buttons, this definitely passes my clicky button test. Next, let's go ahead and test how easy it is to move that alert slider up and down with this case on. So let's go ahead and test that out real quick. And as you can see here, guys, super easy to use, no issues at all. Very easy to access, I'm barely using my fingernails. And last but not least, guys, MagSafe test. So let's see how responsive it is. Boom, as you can see, Definitely MagSafe compatible. Obviously I knew that because it has the built-in magnets, but you always wanna test it just to make sure. So as far as how um, grippy it is on the case, um, as you can see here, it definitely finds those magnets very easily. It is very snug, so it's not like it's just gonna completely fall off if you're shaking the phone. Um, you can also hold the phone, uh, so you are going to be able to use MagSafe accessories in your vehicle as well. Uh, I have been using a couple of different MagSafe chargers in my vehicle and it has not fallen off once in my car and I drive on some very bumpy roads on the way to work. So all in all guys, with this case, it is a really good feeling case. Now the only thing that I think is the, against this case is the price. For 55 bucks, uh, I feel like there might be some better alternatives out there but the nice thing about this case is that you are getting that spec branding. So you know you're getting a case company that knows what they're doing, especially if you do put in your email and get that extra 25% off of this, then you're definitely gonna save a few bucks. Now, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find this on Amazon, but eventually I think it will be on Amazon and it probably will be a heck of a lot cheaper once it is on there. So stay tuned, I will update the links in my description. So as I find it, uh, in other places, I will update some different links in my description. But uh, yeah, there it is, guys. Hit the like button if you liked the video. If you loved it, please subscribe and ring that notification bell for up-to-date content. So be safe, God bless, and we'll see you on the next one.